Look at this dumpster. I kind of want to dive in it. <laughs> oh my god, what is my life? You knew about me. Oh, here we go. We had to send 10 bucks so you can write all that horse shit. Oh, that's right. Fuck, I wish they made it more. <clears throat> I'm a boss ass bitch. In the YouTube algorithm, the people are represented by three separate yet equally important groups. The one that creates, the one that views, and the one that just can't help but react. Under Title 17, I am a member of an elite squad also known as the Special Viewers Unit. These are the stories. You can feel you're watching something really uh, I'm driveway. Can you, so I wake up today, my phone was dead. Good thing, because people were blowing it up. By the way, check this out. Wait, I have hives. I might have to go back to the clinic, I think I have hives from the antibiotics maybe i think i'm in and on live stream and um how cute making breakfast before taking action this guy is like <laughs> unbelievable it just keeps getting worse i'm at my wits end i cannot handle anymore you need to f off like you're gonna go and take action against me for what i didn't delete your video i don't you even said so yourself I changed my password. She has a link to my account. You're letting your... I'm getting um, Starbucks. <clears throat> oh no, I gotta get gas. Sorry. You're letting... Your little minions uh, get in your head. I did not delete your video. I don't have access to your account. Contact YouTube and prove it. Actually, I'm really, really, really looking forward to that. Like, I have no idea what you're talking about. Okay? So, your paranoia... You need to, like, lay off the drugs or something. Okay? I don't know what your problem is, but you're paranoid. Number two, anyone with $20, I could pay someone $20, they could do the same job. Real nice, real nice attitude after I f hours of editing for you. And the fact that you have $4,000 right now is because you have a channel that you're earning ad revenue from. You ungrateful prick. So if anyone can do it, then do it. Edit your videos. Un fuck un unbelievable. And yes, people who are saying, well, now she only wants to contact the police now because she's mad. Well, yeah, because I forgave you. You forgave me for talking about you online. I forgave you for all of the abusive shit you did to me. You don't remember that, right? You want me to list it online? I don't think so. How do you know how much I made? How much he makes? I'm just going based off of, because when he first started, I, I was seeing how much, like I would go into his studio to help him, um, to help him do his videos, like to edit, I have to go in there, right? And while I had access with his account, the only time I ever, he's not going to let this go. When he thinks I deleted one of his videos, that's all he focuses on. Like, if he doesn't care about what he does wrong, he's not wrong at all in this relationship. Or in at all in life, period, with anybody. <clears throat> so, anyway. He, I'm just assuming, he might even make more than that now. I don't know how much he definitively, like, I don't know for sure, for sure how much he made. But, roughly, like, the last time I saw it, it was around that. So that's why, I don't know. It's kind of a guess. Like, you're so ungrateful. I did not delete, I only deleted one bit, like I admitted to that like a long time ago, whenever I was helping him with his account and he was talking all kinds of shit about me in that video. Like, you are the most ungrateful asshole I've ever met in my life. Like, I can't believe that. Oh, and you just, what, you want recognition for helping me? Oh, maybe, that would be nice instead of just being screamed at all the time. I talk a hundred, you talk one. So my way of hurting you is talking online. Your way of hurting me is behind the scenes. Sorry, you don't get to choose how I deal with what you do to me behind the scenes. 
You don't get to choose that. You do what you do and there's consequences for it. I don't know if you know that, like grow up maybe, um, we'll see. You are hanging out with a 50 year old, why doesn't she do these things in life? Oh, I fucking hate people. I mean, seriously, like I don't know how a grown adult can handle being with this guy for like three weeks. Like just watching him whine in bed all day, smoking, coughing, ew, and every time I hear him cough, PTSD, trust me. Trauma, coughing trauma. Like, just get rid of my stuff. You think that you're going to go file a restraining order? They're going to look at your videos, moron. And they're going to see you making fun of me all night with my clothes. You look like an obsessed loser. And you're going to go in and report me? Uh, you're going to go to the police and be like, She deleted my she deleted my YouTube video. Do you have proof of this, sir? And nobody gives a shit about your, your YouTube video that would make $12. Nobody cares about your $12 YouTube video. You want me to apo he you want me to apologize for talking shit about you online? What about my apology? I get all and I get treated like shit from you every day of the week when I'm there. It's bullshit, actually. And I'm not I'm not fucking standing for it actually anymore, period. So, you can play this game. And I'm good at playing games, so you know what? What the fuck? I'm trying to be serious! <laughs> like, Natty acts like he's the superhero protecting his groupies. Oh, don't you talk about Diana Lynn or Corvina. Don't you talk about my harem. Oh, no. My name is Jennifer. You have some fucking nerve. <clears throat> oh, that eye doxter? What? So he deleted his own video and probably blamed it on me because he wants to try to get back at me somehow. Don't fuck with me, okay? Word of advice. So smart was Diana after complaining. She then told everyone her sister's name in capitals just so we were all clear. She's an idiot. What's wrong? Boomer doesn't know how to use technology? Hey, you're, you're, it's not my fault your, your um, geriatric lovers don't know how to use technology, okay? So eat crap. Yeah, and where she works, she doxed herself. So I have to pay for your stupid idiot members doxing themselves? Ugh. Ugh. As you say when you touch my underwear. Ugh. You're ugh. You're big time. Ugh. You didn't sleep two hours? Oh, baby. I slept like a fucking baby last night. I slept like a baby. He's on his way to the courthouse. If he really is, I'm going to the police station right now. I feel like I don't have any like justice or closure. And I feel like a huge injustice has been done to me. So maybe I won't rest until, I don't know. Maybe like going to the police station and just like telling my whole story will just cement everything and end everything for me and that'll be it. I'll let them deal with everything. Early on when I first got with him, he was on the phone with his first probation officer and the probation officer heard me, heard my voice in the background and was like, who's this? Who's that? And then he's like, oh, it's my girlfriend or whatever. And the probation officer was like, does she know about Delphine? Hmm. And at the time I was like, ah, what? Like at the time, I can't believe I just brushed that off. Does she know about your past with, uh, like, basically, like, basically, like, does she know about your past with domestic violence, basically? And me, I'm just like, oh, la la la. Hi, probation officer. Nice to meet you. That's literally like what I said too. I'm fucking like, sorry. I never had a criminal boyfriend before in my life, especially not one for that reason. So no, I didn't know. And for me, when it came with that, didn't set off any red flags because day two he had already conditioned me by telling me all his his wonderful story, his sob story about how Delphine set him up and kidnapped him and blah blah blah. 
Always the fucking victim. Always the victim. I'm the new sob story to tell women about. Yeah! If you look at Delphine, <coughs> Delphine Dyson, D Y S O N, if you look at her Facebook, she, her most recent picture before she died, she had a shaved head. She probably lost her shit. I used to think she was the bad guy. I used to, He made me think that. And now I'm not so sure. And actually, I'm gonna be. Never mind. I know. I know someone who knows her. Reach out to Delphine's daughter, Paige. Sad story. Really? Never. He still has you scared to tell everything or even go to the police. He won't even feel free until you let go all his control. I've been there. Ready, set, rebies for seven months. I'm a little bit, yeah, because... I don't know. I never wanted to do this. I never wanted to do anything legal. I feel like I have to do something. Not your monkeys, not your circus. Gabrielle Lachman. Thing is, next woman's gonna say that. I'm Until he ends up killing somebody. I think I'm stupid for like provoking a dangerous person online and talking about them, yes. <clears throat> Honestly, I feel safer talking about it online. I'm not gonna say that I'm like, I'm not like gonna be like, now that I'm disgruntled, I'm a woman scorned and blah, 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 that's why I'm doing this. Because I was always, I mean, I came online and talked shit about him a lot whenever something would happen. So I was always not happy about things that would happen to me, but I never took legal action or anything because I was always hopeful that things would, he would change and things would work out. And all right, so you guys are going to come with me. We're going to, I'm, I'm going to go to his probation officer's office since I can't find online. I mean, I probably could if I, I'm just lazy. I'm gonna go there and get a card and send her a nice email. I know her name. She watches our videos. I highly doubt that. Well, she probably does, but. <clears throat> she doesn't see the stuff that's not on camera. She just sees you victimizing another person, Dee Dee. You lying ass. I've been friends with her for 11 years. She came into my fish restaurant. I made her like fish. Oh, but then Dee Dee on, 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 on Facebook. Can't wait to try your cooking. Yeah, you can't wait to try his cooking. And the getting on my ass about rubbing it in that I pay for all the food. <clears throat> yeah, if I pay the, and you cook it all for your videos, you don't see, that's the thing. You don't appreciate fuck all. You don't realize what it takes to do a video, to do your videos. Your cooking videos, it's a whole, it takes a whole, it takes people with like the ability to do something. I was doing something nice for you and you fucking treated me like shit behind the scenes. That's my whole point. You don't realize. <coughs> $250 a week minimum on food for your videos all of the hours of editing but that's nothing you're just gonna brush that off I love that that's how you're able to make a living right now and I love how you're brushing that off I did all the hard work you literally come online and fucking stare at the camera with your beak and say thanks for super chat and that's hard work <laughs> And you still have to use me for views. You have my clothes hung up in the background. And you think that you're not going to look insane going to the police and being like, <coughs> Yeah, I, I, I need to file a restraining order against my ex because I'm crazy and I have her clothes on display. You're a moron. You're an idiot.
you're going to be cute and go on your live stream. <coughs> Taking action. So am I. I'm driving to your probation officer right now. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. On the way to Gatineau. On the way to Gatineau. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. He had he was all mad one day like sulking in bed fucking upset because I didn't bring him to his appointment I changed my mind I think what happened was he always rubs this in there was like a time when like there was an appointment for like see like there's no point in me like even talking like <clears throat> there's no point in me defending myself there's no point in me <clears throat> trying to like <clears throat> and I had to learn this it took me a long time to realize this I there's no point in me defending myself against anything there's no point in me explaining trying to rationalize with him because he doesn't think he does anything wrong ever he doesn't get it. He doesn't, he can do no wrong. He is perfect. He never does anything wrong. Um, <clears throat> honestly, I've heard him threaten people, Pete, myself, uh, other people. So yeah, I'm a little reluctant to go to take the law route because that's, once you go that road, it's a little scary. Honestly. So, after today, I'm not talking about him anymore because I'm going to, for sure, I'm definitely pursuing legal action against him. I'm going to write a police report online about every single thing he's done, including kidnapping. And that's it. Goodbye. Remember the first time the police came over and they wanted me to do a police report and I scrapped. I did it, but then I scrapped it. I frantically called around after to scrap it. Please disregard my police report. I didn't want to press. I don't want. I don't want anything to happen to him. Please. is like how do they know it's like truth it's like her word against his word but at the time that it happened I did I did talk about it like actually these are actually I'm glad I talked about him online because all this is video evidence video diary evidence of everything that's ever happened so and what are you gonna what are you going to tell the police about me she went and talked about me online every time I ever did anything bad to her. Anytime I was abusive to her. She talked about it online. Like, what are you going to say? You know you have nothing. <laughs> like, why? <laughs> like, you're insane. You do this to yourself. You make your life hell by yourself. This is all your fault. This is all you're doing. All you're doing, buddy. Not mine. Mm -hmm. All you're doing. 
So I'm gonna go grab a card from your PO. So I'm not going to be scared to anymore. I'm gonna share my story and let the law handle everything. It's kind of out of my hands. Using the way you treat women is disgusting. And Dee Dee, you co-sign that shit and stay at the trap house for three weeks. Boss woman you are is disgusting and beyond me. And honestly, I hope he doesn't seriously harm you. But like, this is ridiculous at this point. I don't know what else to say. Ugh, even just driving back this way, I find honestly, I find it a bit triggering. Just driving like this trajectory. Ugh. Remember that time he had no Wi Fi? Because I shut it off. And then <laughs> I blame Eric was like, somebody super chat, somebody Zupa chat this bum $6.99 for it. Somebody Zupa chat this bum money for a six piece nuggets meal so he can go use the Wi Fi at McDonald's. <laughs> oh my god, it was fucking funny. Here we go. We are in ghetto Gatno right now. Going to the PO office right now. You and Dee Dee better run and catch up with me. Uh oh. <laughs> You're fucking with the wrong one, pal. The wrong one. Ooh, puts in. Give me a minute to think. Where did I drop him before? Rue St. Louis, Quebec, 307 Sonnet. I found it. I'm pretty sure that's it. Hmm. Unbelievable. The nerve. You're gonna get legal action against me? Really? You're the one who did anything criminal this whole relationship. Not me. Because you are a criminal. Boulevard Griba. Okay, hold on. I think you're right. I think it is Griba. Okay, Kimikaze, that's the one that sounds familiar. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna. Ch I, I think that's the one. I saw the picture, and it came up right away in my GPS. Can you believe this guy? Like, if I had gone to the police after first incident happened with him, he would be locked up. And he has the nerve now, 10 months later, to be like, I'm gonna go to the police. This is enough. This is bullshit. She allegedly deleted one of my live streams, which you have no proof I did, which I didn't. And anyway, I think all of the other dozens of videos I have done for you compensates like don't you think so unbelievable <laughs> the balls on this guy take the next right on route 105 north then turn right onto boulevard du casino take the next right onto boulevard du casino signs for auto route 5 money Waukee. then turn right onto the auto route 5 side ramp you gonna win with me not gonna happen. Oh, and sorry, Jennifer Corvina. I know you're hoping that he'll be your next baby daddy, but he can't go to the States because he's a criminal. So sorry. Why did I take this way? There's so much traffic. Oh my god. Remember, I used to make plans with him. Yeah, we can make a travel couples channel. And what? Travel where? You can't travel anywhere. I just have to get a piece of paper. No. You can't. You have a criminal record, so. Take exit two, then keep left. 
I wasn't going to do this today, but he gave me the brilliant idea to do it. And I've been meaning to, obviously. Well, I don't know. I've always been on the fence about it. Because it's not something easy to do. Like, I don't want to... I don't want to ruin someone's life, but... It's not, uh... He's, he's the one doing it, not me. This guy can't even go to his own probation appointments. Blames me for not taking him across the fucking street to Jean Coutu for months to renew, to take take a picture for his stupid fucking health card but we'll walk his ass to the courthouse today to to to, to tattletale on me yeah i believe it okay don't fucking threaten me because when it comes to legal action i'm going to show you today that you will lose every time i know you're listening to uh, your little uh, friends uh, just wait just fucking wait asshole. should have done this a long time ago it's over for you, pal. Keep right at the fork. Anyways, I'm doing people a favor, subjecting them to your salmonella. Who fries chicken for two minutes apiece? And then you want you you would rather eat raw chicken than admit you're wrong. Go figure, typical matter. Can't admit fuck all. Everything I'm gonna tell them. Your threats against Pete's? He's got he's got it coming. I've made up my mind about Pete's. He's gonna he's got it coming. I just have to pay someone money. Yeah, you remember saying those things? Okay, I do. Oops. It's really icy. <laughs> okay. He's at the courthouse having his relocation application approved to move to Montreal. Yeah, we'll see about that. I don't know, should I go in or should I do it online? I wonder if he'll, I hope he doesn't come over here. Read my text, Chantelle Elise. I've seen your text come up here. Show the cops the pic I sent you on Insta. What pic? I am gonna go in. Stop making drugs or nothing. I'm going in. Yes, we're cold. (sighs) 
I can't really talk about it. I have to come back in an hour. I have to come back. I have to go get a bite to eat and come back in an hour. It's more serious than I thought, actually. Okay, let me go get a bite to eat first. Well done. Thank you. Okay, I can't look at the chat. I'm leaving a police station. Um, I'm legally allowed to talk about it. After, just give me time. I can't talk about it right now. But I gotta go back in an hour. I have to call pizza. I was supposed to go with him to get our uh, booster, but the thing is, I got a text from the pharmacy, and they're accepting walk-ins for booster or vaccine. So I'm not gonna go far. I'm just gonna find somewhere. No, Rosewater, but all this is easy to find online. It's all been online. So. No, I didn't. I'm, I'm going back, Nadia. Hi, Terry. It's only been an hour and a half. That's a long time, though. You need to move. He's got crazies obsessed with him and they'll blame you. I need to move. Like, tomorrow. I had to file a police report. A long one. I have to go through my videos and find the dates of certain events. All right, I think I'm gonna go offline and talk to my mom a bit. I gotta be back. How long has it been? Has it been an hour? 30 minutes, okay. Okay, I will be back, don't worry. I won't leave you hanging. I will be back, okay? It's been 30 minutes. Okay, I need to call my mom. Has it been an hour? And then I have to go in. And I might need my phone, so. I'm gonna call Pete's. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye. So, um, they've arrested Natter, and I didn't expect that, honestly. I honestly didn't expect that to happen. I don't know what I expected to happen. Um, I gave my side of the story, um... On what charges? Um, physical abuse or assault or whatever. Uh, confinement and sexual assault. Um, I didn't expect him to get arrested. Uh, yeah. I have Debbie freaking out, video messaging me, uh, messaging me. Um, begging me not to do this, saying I should know he has a good heart. She's still at his house. Um, saying I know he has a good heart. <laughs> I, I want I, I want to tell you, Dee Dee. I want to tell you what he did to me, in case you don't know. So I'm in the, the interrogation room and he's, the investigators going back, like everything is like recorded with like video and everything. 
So I'm going through my videos to try to find these dates of these things. So I do need your guys' help. Like, I'm probably going to have to go to court and everything. So I'm not, like, stuff I say will can be used against me. Um, please don't feel sorry for him and bail him out. What he did to you for 10 months, he deserves jail. I basically said that to Debbie because she was like, he doesn't deserve this. His mom is sick. He was crying before getting handcuffed. I'm like, so I just replied to her. I wrote, he physically, emotionally, and 10 months, he deserves this. They they did ask me too, like, why now? You know, like it basically makes me feel like, I do feel like, oh, well, you were going to go to the cops today. So I'm going to go to the cops. Actually, I've been on the fence about it for like the whole time, you know? I just, I'm not, like, even when I went into the police station, I'm like, how do I go about if I want to, like, possibly, like, report something that happened to me? And right from there, they just, like, took me in right away. He does not have a heart, and she is a piece of shit. Do not help her get back home. She doesn't need help. Or no, she said you were going to help me. You wanted to help me last week? Fix this. She sounded just like him. They're probably in it together. Weird how Dee Dee had no problem with him trying to get you arrested. Did she contact you? Yeah, she did. You always worry that he'd hurt a woman. I would, yeah. And actually, they have May's name. They asked me about May. So they know about May. And some other people, too. So he's where he needs to be. Didi, you don't know him. You need to get your ass home. You, I even have, I know people who are like, if you need me to, to testify for you, I will. That's what I said to the, the guy too. I'm like, does it matter? Like, it doesn't matter. Cause like they asked me like, basically like, would you, Basically, if, like, Didi wasn't there or, like, if if you were still with him, would you be in this police office reporting him? And I'm like, no, probably not. But, like, at the same time, obviously not if I'm with. That's why I haven't reported him yet because I was with him and, and wanted to be with him. I'm not going to put him in jail when I want to be. Like, you know what I mean? I wanted to be with him, so I didn't want to report him. But regardless, it doesn't negate the fact that he put his hands on me. Be with him. Like, does that negate? If I wanted to be with him today after all this, does that negate what he did? And it's like, absolutely not. It doesn't. Yeah, there's some things I haven't told you guys I'm not ready to talk about. Um, You can't just get a restraining order. Thanks, Night Vibe. They're going to ask, they're, I said, is he going to have like no contact with me? And they're like, we're going to ask for that. So I don't know what that means. Do I feel bad thinking about him like crying alone in the cell? Yeah, I do actually. But not really. <laughs> They had to have other cases open on him. That, yeah. That's what they said. They, they didn't give me much information, but. So, um, other women went to the police about him too. Yeah. The Crown will grant you a no contact order, especially when it's abuse and he's repeat offender. Might just not go through until tomorrow. You need to start looking. Oh, really? Place far away. I am. If he spends some time away that, in jail, at least then I can find a place to move. Because, yeah. Debbie has a lot of nerve calling you. Thank you, Jody. I know. Rosemary um, Natter was arrested. They, <clears throat> the investigator asked me about some other women's names I didn't recognize. So there must have been other women, but, but May Anderson was there. So there must be something. How much is this bond? This friend with benefits. I think if you're on probation, you don't get bail. But I'm not sure. I showed him the, the screen of him calling me Delphine number two. I show everything. Everything. I'm glad I documented everything online. Because I don't have bruises to show. 
So Miss like, hi, Annie. You shouldn't have to move. That's just another way for him to control you. Stay and stand your ground. Get security cameras. Hmm. He's probably, yeah, he would be mad. Well, fuck. I'm going to need weekly appointments, yeah. Geez, recording, of course. Um, I don't know the exact, I so I think, I don't know the exact charges, like, um, I can't remember if they said physical assault or physical abuse or uh, confinement, I know, is one for sure. Uh, sexual assault or something. I don't know. I don't know the exact exact charge. I don't want to give, like, false information, but well, I just want to move on from him, honestly, and just, I don't know, Stabby Use, if Didi wasn't there from the Windsor trip, you would be there now. I don't know. The fact that I didn't want, I didn't bring him to Windsor, to me, that was in good faith, um, a gesture that I, I was ready to move on. I was going to bring him to um, Windsor, but the tequila stuff happened. So, yeah, Liliana, he does have some scary friends. He said that he has friends. He met some scary friends in prison, people who don't mind killing people for $500. Yeah. He definitely, to me, in my opinion, he belongs in jail. Like, he doesn't, he's a danger to society. He's a danger to people. When you have multiple women coming forward and saying that he's sexually including me. He wouldn't pay anyone to do anything to you. It's awful, but I think that's something he'd rather do himself. Honor real man stuff in his dumb mind. Yeah, but then again, he's also a coward. But yeah, you're right, Daisy. Maybe Maria's world, your voice, save future women. Didi's in Gatineau. Yeah, she's at his house. I'd be more nervous if I was you. They kept asking me, like, are you going to be okay? I don't know. I am I am nervous. Hella nervous. I'm glad he was arrested. Maybe he can make prison cooking videos. Cheeto soup with raw Vienna sausages smothered in melted Hershey's bar. Commissary my way. Someone's calling me. Hello? Hello? Yes. Yeah, it's Hi. Uh, did you ask to back? Yes, I'm home now. Okay. So he will stay out until he's brought to court, like to uh, court. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 
Okay. Okay. Yes, that's clear. Okay. Well, thanks for letting me know. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So he went to. The, you said he went to the hospital. Yeah. So he'll get released and like go back home. Okay. 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 Yeah. Thank you for letting me know. Good night. Um, so he is at the hospital. He got taken to the hospital by paramedic. And they can't hold him for more than 24 hours. So after the hospital, he's going to be sent back home on condition. He can't have any contact with me. He can't come near my address. He can't talk about me online or nothing. But <sighs> he doesn't give a shit. He has, he's going to get to stay home until condi with, a condition, uh, with conditions until he has to appear in court. Uh, uh, should I go stay at a hotel? <laughs> He's probably, he probably like knows this. He knows he's not stupid. He probably faked being sick to go to the hospital knowing that they can't hold him now. He thinks this is all to get back at him. He thinks this is, this is like, you did this to me. Can I get arrested for anything? No. For what? Mistress Rebecca, get a ring cam ASAP and a better lock. Or what about a doorbell camera? Triggered Andy. He probably had a panic attack if he was crying. Yeah. Um, I went to the police station to fill out a report and they arrested Natter and he went to the hospital and he's going to be released. You have a shit ton of evidence. Yeah. Everything's online. I told the guy that. Meow, yeah, is there no hate? Just honestly curious. Why did you defend him about May's situation and allegedly provide false alibi? Um, that's not really what happened. Like, Meowser, I gave the information I knew at the time. At the time, I went online and, like, showed those things. Like, like, I was with him that day. I don't remember what I said, but, like, that's what I believed to be the truth at the time. And because I didn't believe May because of her saying, your rejection of me. Like, so, normally, you know what I mean? But I don't know. I don't know about the May situation. I can't, I can't say what happened because I was not there, you know? So. But yeah, you went for today to go to the cops. Yep. I guess today was the day. You got proof on your channel and everything. You deleted it. Okay. Because I was tired of him fucking of his constant harassment and trying to humiliate me every day with my clothes and just and then, and then I'm going to take action. You're going to take action? Really? No, I'm going to take action. Because you're the one in the wrong and you're going to fucking like he's oh, he's not smart. Chantal, I'm in Toronto and my sister went through the same thing. Contact victim services. Yeah, they're supposed to get in touch with me. He lied to you about meeting me for a reason. I know. This is why people don't report their abusers all the time. Who is May? Oh, it's a long story. He goes to the hospital and he's allowed to go home. I know. Indeed, he's there. Helga, he's on probation. How doesn't he have to go to jail? I don't know, Helga. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if this is going to do anything. I've... I don't know. I guess. Yes, BBJ has an appointment on Saturday. It's a paper trail in case anything happens. I thought I was just going to fill out a report. I didn't think they were going to actually go and arrest him. For real, I didn't think that. Oh, do you want to hear what... So, did I really? Savannah Banna, you said earlier you don't have any... You don't have pics of bruises, but you have vids with big-ass thumbprint-shaped bruises. 
and the big one on your face. There, there. Really? Oh, I don't remember that, Savannah. Yeah, the one on my breast, I'm not going to say those are not, but those were from sex. I'm not, uh, I had to take an actual oath. I'm going to be honest. His hair must be raging right now. I'm dying. Yeah. <laughs> now there's gonorrhea. I told them about that. I told them everything. They're very thorough. They ask you questions. Don't worry, Debbie. Your new uh, mate will be back with you tomorrow. Yeah, so she, she, this is what she has the nerve. I get video messaging, obviously, when he was arrested. And then she says, Chantelle, are you really going to ruin this man's life? You know just as well as I do that he has a good heart. He has been arrested, spending night in jail, being interrogated until tomorrow, where he needs to present himself in front of judge tomorrow. You wanted to help me out last week. I am begging you to call me and talk about this as mature adults. Nader did not go to the police or court today. I talked him out of it. This is serious, Chantelle. Try calling me. And then she said, Chantal Natter might be going back to jail. Please stop listening to your VIBs. This is real life with consequences that will affect him and his family. He spoke to his mom today and she is very ill. Please, Chantal, fix this. Call me. Please, I'm begging you. If you want me to leave tomorrow, I will. Natter is a good fucking hell. They really think this is a... You really think I'm just mad that you're there. Uh, if you want me to leave tomorrow, I will. Natter is a good friend and it breaks my heart to see this all happening. Please, Chantal, fix this, please. Chantal, I am here in his place tonight. He was crying before cops handcuffed him to go to the station. Please, Chantal, fix this. You know deep down he does not deserve this. So finally I answered her and I said, he physically abused me and me for 10 months. He deserves this. Goodbye, Debbie. See you later. You have no idea what I've been through. Like, none. That's what pisses me off. And then you just get called down here to fix everything? Like, you have no idea what this guy put me through. His mom raised trash. Exactly. Like, excuse me like you want me to feel sorry for him after everything he's he's friggin done and not just that but i've you want me to feel sorry for his mom i gave him money for his mom like to help him and how did he repay me yeah so no actually i do feel bad and that's the problem i shouldn't he should feel bad but he doesn't he's probably gonna try to fucking kill me or something i'm not kidding if something happens to me you know what happened You defended him against me. Yeah, maybe she just doesn't believe it happened. Just like I didn't believe. You're right. That's how it happens. Rachel Burke, how can you even be sure the money actually went to his mother? Maybe she's in a scam. I can't be sure. I can't trust a thing he says. And let's not forget Dee Dee over at the trap laughing all the horrible things he says about you. Yep. You're home safe. Thank God what I'm happening. Oh, Gail. They arrested him, but... Where was Dee Dee when you were crying, trying to get your medical device? She wasn't feeling bad for you. Exactly. I'm not fucking giving her the time of day. Let's talk like adults. Dee Dee needs to stop press charges on her with a TPO. She needs to zip it. He cannot use her to torment you. It will be a violation of TPO. Exactly, Norma Jean. That's what I should have said. Can you use other people to harass me? Don't tell us bake lasagna. Say Dee Dee three times in the mirror and she shall appear. Bake lasagna. Sophie King, ignore the assholes. A lot of us are proud of you. Thank you, Sophie King always listen to you. <laughs> Just start blocking people and keep them blocked. You don't need any negative energy in here. Yeah, if people really bug me, I'll block them. A real man wouldn't cry and claim suicidal thoughts to avoid spending the night in jail. Nader is a little bitch. You think he did that? She made fun of you and laughed her ass off when Nader was stretching her clothes and fat shaming. They're like, can you describe him? I'm like, uh, 130 pounds. No, I'm just kidding. I didn't say that. And I'll please be careful with what you say. Don't let people bait you. Yeah, Raquel, I'm not going to. Bees and Sam, it doesn't matter if I cry DV one minute or not. It doesn't change the fact that he did it. Like, you, people shouldn't even ask if you want to press charges. It should just happen. If somebody uh, physically assaults somebody else, it should just happen. And yes, I should have gone earlier to the cops. But you can say that about a lot of people. MG, can you please apologize to me and all the other women that said he was an abuser and you defended him and laughed because you loved him. It would be a new start and a new startup piece. You were wrong. I don't know, MG, what happened, um, but I am sorry for May for laughing at her story. I didn't laugh at her story, but I defended him and I didn't know what happened, so I apologize for that and for downplaying her experience and I really hope nothing happened to her. I think I just wanted to put it out of my brain. Oh God, bad seed. And if something did happen to her, that is horrible. And I really, really, really hope it, like, I don't know.
I couldn't admit to myself that that could possibly be true, you know, like, and I think maybe Didi is maybe doing the same thing. She doesn't want to admit to herself it can be true, you know. <clears throat> Grammar, please. Watch what you say. They are going to try and build something on you. Nader will pretend he wants you back. Zero contact. Just record everything he says. I will, Grammar. Police, don't worry. You are Nader's piggy bank. MG, thank you for apologizing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. <laughs> thank you, MG. For your super chat. Most often women will stay with their abusers. You did it for two years. I know, like, everyone's story is different and unique. You know, like, no one's story should be compared to the other. Everyone has their own story. Whether you were abused once, whether you were in an abusive relationship for 15 years, it doesn't matter. No, yes, I'm glad I don't have children with him. Been through this type of relationship, knows why you kept going back and understands what you've been through. He, like, actually at one point, like, almost convinced me like i deserved it like for real that's another reason like what the the investigator asked me too like why i would go back like there's a mixture of reasons i sort of believed him but like i felt bad he made me feel bad he made me feel like shit feelings that now i honestly cannot believe i even had like whenever i say i compromise my morals for him i mean that like not reporting it sooner just completely overlooking the fact that he was an abuser is completely compromising my morals. If he comes, but then I can call the cops on him, grammar police and have him arrested. Like if he breaks any of these conditions, if he even like texts me or like anything, he'll go back to jail. I don't understand why you fell for him in the first place. He only knows a handful of, I don't care about the language really Karen. It's mostly just like, I just, um, the second day I met him, he gave me this huge sob story. He um, he gave me a huge sob story about his life, and I um, oh, okay, Wiccan, thank you. Exactly, Julie. He doesn't have my number, so the crown is taking up the case against him. That's how it is, yeah, Liliana. Spurts. He should have not been violent then those were his choices to make no one made him be an abusive little biznatch actions have consequences exactly spurts thank you exactly like i'm actually a little bit feeling bad for him right now whenever he's like oh they sent whenever the guy was like they sent him to the hospital i, I, I like instinctively wanted to be like really like that's how i want to hit myself like remember when he threatened to release your news yeah he better not max love bombs like crazy yeah like, like, if I, like, listed, like, in a row every single thing he did bad, you guys would be, like, you would probably throw up. When you go to court, ask for your new pics. Ah, I will. I want him to delete them in front of the judge. Natter's on parole because he stabbed people. Refugee, not even Canadian. Physical abuse. Confinement. Natter's going to prison for a long time. I need your help. I need your help. I need to find the dates I need the links to, does anyone know the dates or live streams where I talk about the dates of certain events? Like um, the one where I talk about where he, I had to sneak out and leave and like where my keys were hidden. I have to like go through my stuff and find like my stuff. To, like, um, but I know a lot of you are quick to find stuff. You know what I mean? They reaction channels to do this. I probably did a lot of those vids. I did. Okay. I have to move Curly. And private my videos. I should unprivate my videos. I know April 23rd was when I said I have a new I have a boyfriend. So that's around the time I met him in April. I'm gonna give it to you. You're smart for not blocking people that give you money. Uh, I would have blocked you on first sight. <laughs> Voice of reason have changed. Find it yourself and private your vids. Yeah, I guess I probably did. Yeah, I guess I'll have to go through Kiwi. Kiwi Farms does too much, though. That would take forever, too. The day of the incident, of the big fight. I know it was in the summer. I just don't remember what day. He didn't kick me that time, Cotton Candy. He shoved me, though. Paper clips live. The reaction channel probably has their live title. That. Oh, yeah.
I could probably honestly put together a whole video of evidence of me in, in my live streams with the dates talking about the incidents. That's what I need to do. I wonder if I could pay someone to do that. Or maybe I'll do it myself. So they said they were he was going to go and take action against me and he never did. Lindsay Thomas. My whole life is chronicled, I know. Do you think reaction channels are just as important? They can be, yeah. Yeah. Angela Lackman. I know it overwhelming, but look at all the shit he put you through. Yeah, because they're kind of like an archive in a way. The shit better be worth what's coming next. What do you mean it better be worth? What did I do to him? Like, don't forget that. He's not the victim here. Ugh, let him come to me. If one of us ends up offing each other, whatever. I'm fucking tired of running. I'm not going to be scared of him. I'm not going to run from him. Actually, I'd be more tempted to put Pete's and the cats in a hotel. Yeah, Mary, Queen of Hearts. He's probably in hospital with drug withdrawal. That or panic attack or something, Queen of Hearts. No, I'm not threatening him. I'm just saying that's... Let me put my candles on. I mean... I'm not threatening him. Did you go see my butt? I can't, anyways. I, I mean, I couldn't hurt him. He's... He's, uh... He's natter. I mean, he... <laughs> Here we go. All right. Okay. Anyways, guys, I have this microphone. This microphone here. Ice. Kaneki. I don't know if it's a restraining order, but he has conditions that he's not allowed to contact me in any way or be near my house. But as if a piece of paper is going to stop him from anything. God. Anyways, I'm just going to stay live for like a week. I don't feel sorry for him. Piece of paper will stop him because he will go to jail. Uh, mini churros with birthday. What topic am I supposed to be weigh, uh, weighing in on? Some news about Natter. He, the police called. He's faked something to get sent to the hospital. So now, because they can't hold him for more than 24 hours, they have to release him. Once he's at, out of the hospital, they're going to send him back home. On condition he can't contact me but but uh i'm still a little scared that he might anyways if he tries ignore him if he tries then i have to report it and he can go back to jail practice my sword skills Hold on, I'm just ordering something, guys. Mini churros. Let's get six. And obviously it's worthwhile to not talk about him at all on your channel as well. Huh? I'm saying it's worthwhile to not talk about him on your channel at all. Yeah. One topping, two for one pizza. You don't want a pepperoni pizza? No, no. At least I like. I'm. I don't have an appetite these days. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah. Well, I'm going back to sitting down. Okay. Well, sorry, Pete. No problem. Let me know when your food's here so I can get it for you. Thanks. No problem. <laughs>